Hey guys, welcome back to another part of Star Wars Battlefront. In the last part, we took care of Desert Extermination now the Siege of Moss Eisley. So, let's jump into that. Local smugglers from Moss Eisley have escaped with the rebel droids. It is time to bring Imperial order to Tatooine. Seize control of Moss Eisley and terminate any who resist. Okay, so the droids escaped from Moss Eisley with the help of local... Uh, who gives a crap? Lord Vader's here, and we got Dark Troopers, so yay. Okay, loading screen, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Come on. Okay, um, usually spawn here. Actually, why don't I just show off? I haven't been showing off the very units at all, so... I'll at least show off the Dark Troopers, see? Jetpack, rather different from, um... Jet Troopers. You can't shut it off at any time. Basically goes until you touch the ground. So, it's really preferred to more as a jump pack. Basically, madly extend your jump, and then rape with the shotgun. Okay. I'm almost dead, so... Let's get these, okay. And, ah, uh, they threw thermal detonators, so I gotta... Oh, whatever. Now we're in their base, so I'm just gonna switch to regular stormtrooper. Yeah, I don't... I'm pretty sure I explained this, but I usually just prefer to use a regular trooper for this, and I don't know what the heck that job was doing that to that door, but... <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Basically, my main plan is to go in here and take the cantina, because that's about the easiest one to take. And then it's also the closest to your side, so... It's this one to any of your command posts. And showing off a little glitch here, if you jump on uh, another person's head, you'll actually stay up there. And if you run with them, you can actually basically continue running on top of their head. It's pretty funny. Okay, now I'm inside that. Enemy okay, in range. took him out. Actually, it's a her. The Rebel Sniper is the only female unit in the game, I'm pretty sure. Unless the Wookiee Smuggler is actually female, I don't really know. Whatever, just kind of hide out here because open space, there's a ton of them right now, especially since we took one of their command posts already, so just slowly slip in here, and hopefully, uh, probably gonna die. Ah, oh, yep, I missed the door. It's too far out to get the door, so crap, whatever. Not by that. Let me just spawn back here. You can go for like either or with these last two command posts, it doesn't really matter. Actually you can do whatever the heck you want, but that's just what I usually like to do. Let's try to go for the command post. And now I'm getting sniped from behind. Yep. Oh, the wiki got me with this stupid grenade launcher. Okay, come on, let's go. Alright, so yeah. Oh my gosh, no. <laughs> right, so we got a decent lead. As long as we just sustain things the way they are, it should be fine. Should I go that way? No, let's go this way. Okay. So, yeah, um, you can kind of sneak through here. Game kind of glitches out. You can't go through that one, but I think you can go through the rest. Okay, maybe not.
Computers can be kind of annoying to. Well, actually, anyone can be annoying to fight out in the open. Because I'll try to lead these stupid computers and they'll know exactly. Like, I'll get one hit in and then they'll immediately stop moving and go the opposite direction. Like, they know right when I'm about to hit them with the first shot. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. Like, sometimes. Like, I really don't like to play as a sniper in this game because. I'll get a stupid enemy computer in my sights and right when I fire they move out of the way like the exact second I push the R1 button to fire they move out of the way it's really annoying yeah this way okay so them, just sneak through here. Ow! Wow, my computer ally was actually smart and didn't run into it, and I messed up again. I'm dead. So, yeah, that's the first time I've killed myself. <laughs> um, I think there's someone over here. Yep. Uh, yep. Yeah, just imagine that, but then like 20 feet away and still doing about the same amount of damage and that should give me an idea of how burning the shotgun is so let's take out the pilot first and this guy shouldn't be too much of a problem even though um rocket launchers really can destroy enemies not just vehicles computers are just programmed not to use them against other people at all and I can complain too much because they just waste all their ammo and since your own computer allies can still cause weapons can still Enemy give you knockback range. on some levels I can just send you flying and get you killed yeah just toss that grenade, take care of a few of them this guy gets flushed out and take care of them okay. I think they're right there, yep Ah, oh, well, I was about to throw it and then I guess I <sighs> okay, so the battle's about winding down. They're down like 20 guys, so. Victory is imminent. Um, I'll just go. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> Pilot's actually missing. Yeah. Usually they'll actually nail me with that. Like. It almost seems to be a pattern. The first shot they'll miss, and then the second one, bam, I'm dead. Objective acquired. Incoming! Take cover! Kind of annoying, but what am, um, he can take care of that guy. I'll just jump in here and take care of these last few Enemy in range. guys. Okay. Take him out. Let's take care of you. I don't know what the heck you're doing, but whatever. Um, is there anyone else in here? I think they're all over at the other command post, so let's just go take care of them. Didn't really explain it, but there's Jawas all over this level. And they're considered allies to both sides, so if you kill one, it takes a kill away from your account. So, with that in mind, um, they also have they all have fusion cutters, which basically are what you use to build turrets and repair vehicles. So that's what they do. They just run around and like build turrets and whatnot. So yeah, we won that. Eight deaths. That's not too good. Uh, whatever. Yeah. Second level of the campaign. Even though it's on horror, that's none too good. Uh, hopefully, you can pick that up a bit. See? Okay, we got Tank Buster and. Did, er, wait, no. Killing Spree. Yeah, I just looked at it. Because I was like, wait, there's no vehicles on this level. Well, actually, there can be vehicles on that level, but. Only for the droids in the Republic, or for the Empire, if they capture the hangar. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and save this, and, uh... Um, oh, long Yeah, shut up. I don't care. Okay. So, we took care of Caesar Moss Isley, and the next part will handle sabotage at Renvar. See you guys.